Neil Popco Studios in Oklahoma City. This is an OSU update with Gina Mizell. I'm Jenny Carlson. Gina, questions heading into this season for the Cowboys about kicker, punter, because Quinn Sharp did it all for the Cowboys mm -hmm. a year ago. So what do we know at this point about how things are shaping out with those special teams positions? We know that Ben Grogan is going to be the starting kicker. Uh, Mike Gundy revealed that after the scrimmage on Saturday night. He's obviously the true freshman coming in, was rated the number nine kicker in the nation by rivals. He was went to a very um, highly touted high school, uh, beat out Jaden Overcrum from TCU, who's a preseason all Big 12 pick. They went to the same high school and uh, Ben Grogan beat him out as a junior when Overcrum was a senior. So high expectations coming in for this guy already. I think a lot of people expect him to win this job mm -hmm. but yeah it's now official he's going to be your kicker going into the season opener and, and part of that was because uh, Mike Gundy revealed that Bobby Stonebreaker is no longer with the team at least right now doesn't mean he's gone for good mm -hmm. but kind of because of that Grogan's your guy but I think he was going to win the job no, no matter what. So no punter has been named right and Grogan hasn't been named as the kickoff uh, specialist yet so those two jobs are still open where do those two stand? Yeah Gundy said that he's still trying to figure figure that out at this point and um, there's two guys that could be the punter. Um, Grogan actually did punt, but it sounds like they're not going to have the same guy kick and punt. So you've got Michael Reichenstein, who has a grand total of one punt throughout his Cowboy career in 2011 against Kansas. And then Kip Smith, who's kind of an intriguing, interesting guy. He was rated the number one kicker in the country coming out of high school in 2010. Went to UCLA, redshirted a season, then played two games, What was the starting kicker and got hurt. Has now transferred to Oklahoma State. Was here last year on campus, but didn't play football. And he's the guy that can kick and punt so he might be in the mix to punt he also might be in the mix to do kickoffs as well apparently has a big leg and and has recovered from his from his injury from previously so again they're kind of some interesting things to monitor but at least one of those jobs is settled now which it's not all going to go to one guy not like Quinn Sharp but uh, one of those uh, we've partially replaced Quinn Sharp and still have I guess two more thirds to go in that, in that uh, task. I think we now know how much Quinn Sharp meant to this team. Absolutely. <laughs> all right thanks Gina. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoman.